Hello, in this video I'll present to you cleanup. It's a command which only works with smart magnet rigs and takes care of your twinned elements to animate along arcs. So we have two poses here, this one and this one. And when we activate a classic tween, we instantly see a problem which uh, flash animators have been facing for years. Twinned elements move along straight lines, so the limbs overlap and break in the middle of the tween. And this is uh, what cleanup takes care of. So how does it work? We need to select all the elements that we would like to clean up and execute the command. In this case, we will only not select this foot here and the command is just here in the menu clean up smr with the shortcut key of alt plus q so when we execute the command after a couple of seconds all these keyframes are generated here which basically make the movement happen along arcs and the elements don't overlap now, the automatically generated keyframes are all marked with uh, a comment label, just so that we can distinguish them very easily from our own real keyframes. There is a problem in some versions of Animate where these uh, comment labels slow down uh, timeline playback. That means uh, when you hit enter, this can be slower than uh, if there weren't any comment labels. So there is an option to switch comment labels off. Now I'll uh, remove these keys by just, just removing them and show you where this option is. If we call edapt control panel, we go to miscellaneous and here it is, label processed keyframes. By default, it's disabled. So. I'll disable it now and do the cleanup again. Now we can start either from a stage selection in the left key and the cleanup will go from the left to the right. In previous versions of EDAP tools, we were going from the right to the left. But as of uh, EDAP tools version six, we go left to right or we can start with a timeline selection i'll just move this uh, foot out of the way and make a timeline selection and go alt plus q which is clean up and there you go now you can see there's no labels here on those um, automatically generated keyframes and the playback might be a little fast now i'll show you Another trick that you can use when cleaning frames up, I'll give these 100% easing and then I will add a little bit of um, extra dynamic to these. So for example, I will change this to add a little bit of extra drag in the head by copying this and then splitting the values so I'll leave the position like this but then change the rotation graph slightly and now we have this extra movement as you can see I will do something similar to other elements so let's just change the timing of this arm it doesn't really matter that it just jumped because when we clean it up all the elements will uh, just go back in place and I will do this trick for the leg and the foot so the leg I'll uh, split these keep the position going with easing of 100 and then change the rotation a little bit so that uh, we have a bit of a delay there and I will do the same for the foot like this 
files. Now it disassembles, but you can see there's some probably nicer dynamic there. And now I will select and execute cleanup by pressing Alt plus Q. And we can now see the animation. Okay, so you can you can see there's um, a little bit of an overlapping action and it looks nice. So this is how you clean up your arcs in all versions of Flash and animate that do not have layer parenting. And even if you have access to layer parenting, it may still be easier and more convenient to use cleanup. Thanks for watching.